What is up guys, back in today with another reaction to Near Automata, this time with episode 20 of part 2. Uh, looking forward to this one, had a banger last week, um, as usual, this season's been absolutely immense so far, and I think we can expect an action heavy episode today, considering we, uh, this village here is going to be getting attacked, as well as uh, Nines, on his little mission, which is some very sus goings on there, now I say. But um, yeah, do let me know what you guys think about this one in the comment section. Leave a like on my video if you guys you like, and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date. And uh, yeah, let's see what we got. I already got a, a machine and a giant mech right here. They're coming. Ah, shit. Joel, this kind of reminds me a little bit of like Attack on Titan. <laughs> Um, like the titans to these machines. I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> Let's go. Bit of brains, bit of smarts. The operation. They're just charging in. Oh, there's plenty more that come from. Oh no, they've got mechs. Yes, you do that. I want to see no casualties here, by the way. So I very naive in thinking, but what I want. There's just a shit ton of them. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Just 360. What are these? Oh shit. Never seen those. Indeed. Ah oh, no. Oh, what a legend! Ah, they all are very little, though, aren't they? On our side, but oh, damn. Jesus, Pascal, what the fuck? Holy shit! <laughs> Why is that so hype? Fucking Pascal coming through a machine gun as well as missiles. What the fuck? If the game didn't let you play as Pascal here, then the, the, yeah, there's something wrong. <laughs> Even not being able to play as him, I imagine it'd be cool just having that show up by your side. Like, fucking hell, Pascal. You, you really came to play here. Fuck me. Passionate about the uh, survival of the village. Oh, sorry. That's got me, that is. Fucking Pascal. Let's go, man. I don't know why. It's just something so endearing and awesome about these machines. Oh, they won me over instantly. There's not many shows that can do that, to be honest with you, for me. I feel like the show is super underrated. But maybe that just says a lot about the source material. Like it's quite rare you get... I mean, don't get me wrong, there's plenty of games and such that have good adaptations. But from my experience as a kid, again, I've spent this before about seeing like game adaptation, like movie adaptations of games. They're always crap when I was a kid. Um... It's got to take something special either in the game or the, the adaptation to be this fucking good. I 
I mean, recent example, the Borderlands movie that just came out. I love that series. It's not it's not well suited for a, a movie whatsoever though. Fucking hell. What an absolute machine. Literally and figuratively. Pascal is. Jeez. That was ridiculous. I was expecting A2 to be the major player here. But she didn't even really do that much. <laughs> Gratitude, please. I mean, you you could just fly away, Pascal, <laughs> if you really wanted to. Well, again, that was over a lot quicker than I expected. Oh, the family. Looks like there wasn't too many issues, and yeah, what, what there was probably could be fixed. Anything about being a robot? Oh, little kids. I did kind of had a feeling it wasn't fully over. That's more like bomb units. Oh no. You know, you know after we've just had all this niceness, things and now we're just going to shit, aren't they? Shit. <sighs> well, I was hoping, again, I was hoping that was it, but... Ugh. Oh, the last week I felt bad for the robots that got killed by nines. Even more so for these guys. My God. Holy crap, man. Fucking hell, everybody's dead. That's happened a lot this season. Jesus. Well, I, I got... I got way too comfortable with us winning that. <laughs> Just uh, it's for everyone to die. Should have known better. And I think that was my hopes kind of uh, deluding me, perhaps a little bit there. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, all those poor robots.
Here we go again. Sour box. I'm not it's horrible. Oh there is a uh, there's that guy. Um I'm not too mad about the village. Like we you can create another place like this. And it's the lives of these people, isn't it? Fucking these things again. I did fight one of these in the game when I played it. I need to buy it again. I've got lots on my plate at the minute. <laughs> I think I said last week I've recently just finished Okami. I did not, did not expect that to be 40 hours, but it was fucking fantastic. We also, of course, fought them in the first episode of the anime. I pretty much played through that first episode. The point I got to. I should probably watch the first episode again. Thinking about it. Library. Oh shit. So we'll Adam and Eve on that. Launch pad. Oh, I love games like Resident Evil that have uh, lots of discoverable kind of things for the story. More so about like what you find and what this what the actual game tells you. Oh shit. Limiter. So are you saying the 2B that we that we saw was not capable of this?
I think it's just come to understand what type of woman you are. <laughs> this box at this point. That's going to be, yeah, quite the hill to swallow for nines, actually, isn't it? Ah, interesting. They are one and the same. It does, with what we've seen, like the village and stuff, it does very much seem like they're a much more elementary version, an unevolved version of these uh, androids. They're like beginning their way on that path of sorts. I don't know. Oh, you did get told. Um, I wasn't expecting this box to be able to do anything. This is probably what you could help with. Maybe not. <laughs> What's jumping into action? Oh crap! And also, is he hacked? What? Oh my god! Again, please let me. Please tell me you're allowed to play as Pascal in this game, so you get to control that thing. Pascal's been such a beast this episode, what the hell? In lui no eco ale. These are the precious files, these ones. <laughs> this is the, the precious folder. Is. 
Have we ever? Has there ever? See, not what I've seen, but has there ever? Universe been a uh, android so emotionally distraught signs so weak. Not weak is the wrong word, but it, like he's weak right now. He's super emotional. He's super affected by her death. Has there ever been an android so affected by this? I struggle to believe there is, but maybe there might have been. We obviously saw the backstory for 1A, is it? Oh, I always forget the names. <laughs> A2. A2, that's the one. And uh, that, was, that was... We saw a similar level of destroy. It obviously turned her into the person that she is today, but... I mean, it's just crazy. Seeing these reactions when, again, we, we were told about the first season. These things shouldn't have shouldn't have emotions. Shouldn't display them. Well past that. <laughs> well, well past that. But yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. I probably should pause because of copyright. That'd be a smart idea. I will just skip to the end here. If I can get it. Oh, yeah, that's... Tactical support unit again. I think MVP of today was definitely Pascal, isn't it? Holy crap! Although I love that little end segment with nines, and of course A2 was fantastic as well. But Pascal, what the hell was that? <laughs> what the hell was that? I wasn't expecting to be handy whatsoever. Okay, let's pause through this. Convent. No. Bloody adverts. Let me pause, please. Oh my god. There we go. About the math. <laughs> About the matter on hand, scheduling is a critical is in a critical state at this rate. A large scale incident may occur. Uh, they are all exhausted and require immediate attention. Proposal: respite, double double orders, maintenance. Agreement. However, stopping the work process would be a grave incident on its own. Timing of the items they call discs will sh uh, shift as well, which will likely affect the sales and. Of said items. What do you think about that aspect? <laughs> you know, this is how I, I, I think I mentioned a few weeks ago. I had a chat with GPT, and it was always asking me, like, "What do you think about that aspect?" and, and things like that. <laughs> it was like I was asking it questions, but more so, it was actually asking me questions. Similar to how we have duties, they also have duties they must fulfill. Just as sacrifices have been made, it will likely be as such in the future. Yeah, good. I can't keep up with that. Oh, no. No, I don't like that. I mean, they already got through the multi endings, the actual ones, and uh, we weren't exactly doing that at the end of every episode. But um, does that mean there's not going to be any end, more end segments? I mean, if that helps with production, because again, we know season one had production issues. Part one, should I say, had production issues. If it if it means the end segments are gone at the at the benefit of the series as a whole then fair enough um is what it is but i really like the end segments of it and they're really playful and nice but yeah thank you guys for watching uh, again fantastic episode uh lots of action in here of course uh super hype for pascal <laughs> he was uh he or she again i, I don't really care uh was uh, was fantastic today a2 was pretty cool as well i, I did expect her to start a bit more at the start but pascal just blew things away um and again took me uh Again, got my hopes up that we won that easily, but I should have known, really, shouldn't I? Um, nice uh, segment of nines at the end here as well. Again, just uh, every time we see him, it's just kind of 
soul destroying a little bit isn't it seeing the state that he's in but yeah another fantastic episode uh, let me know what you guys thought of this one in the comment section leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date hopefully that's not the end of those end segments but i guess we'll find out next week and i'll see you guys then